Hello friends, thanks for joining me today and I'm going to show you how to make this easy breezy ginger drink. First, you want to clean the ginger. You must, must, must clean it. Clean it good because we're going to use the skin on everything. Now be careful when you're grinding, when you're gratering the juice because grater, these teeth are so razor sharp. Trust me, just take your time. This obviously is a timed video so I hurried it up but please just take your time when you do it because I've been cut several times it's not nice so don't want to waste anything we we'll have all the trash scraped out we're gonna use our water now the water will determine how much water how much water you use will determine how potent the ginger is how light the flavor is or how strong the flavor is um, you always want to also taste your ginger as you go because you need to know how much more water to add or how less water to add and that's how you determine how much sugar you need to add also always 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 taste the ginger drink as you go so we're going to use up all of this that's left back here with some more water and now we're going to strain the ginger you gotta use your hands if you want to use gloves that's fine too this is the only way you're gonna strain this ginger I don't know how else anyone else can strain the juice out of the, the grated ginger this is it old school all the way and the trash we're gonna put some more water in there because there's still some ginger ginger up in there so we're not gonna waste it so we're gonna put a little bit more water in there mix it around a little bit and then we're gonna strain it one more time it up some more okay so let's taste it first and then we can know what the potency is oh, yeah. whoa it's hot that's the way I like it it's traditional it's spicy you feel it going down your throat and you're going to love it so we squeeze out a little bit that's left boom okay before we add sugar let's taste it some more just to see the potency and I just use one cup of sugar here because like I said I'm making it traditional and it has to be strong and spicy if you make it for children use pineapple juice to sweeten it or honey or just add a little bit more water to cool down the potency or the, the flavor of the ginger if it's too strong try not to use too much sugar is basically the point so we're gonna pour it here if you want to store it you can store it on put it up but we're going to serve it now here's some pure facts on the ginger roots itself it clears up congestion um, smooths your sore throat improves your indigestion it has so much powerful antioxidants it is just the bomb let's serve it with some pineapples and see how it tastes yeah man these pineapples are frozen so it just makes it totally appropriate step is the taste test let's see yes or no yes of course it's amazing ginger juice check us out again next time for another episode of cooking with black girl